Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Xbox app error message 0x80071128 that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. The error message reads that something unexpected happened. Reporting this problem will help us understand it better. You can wait a bit and try again or restart your device. That may help. Error code 0x80071128A. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and type in settings. Best result, should come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the left side, you want to select apps. And then on the right side, underneath apps, you want to select installed apps. In the search apps field at the top, search for Xbox. And then for the Xbox app, select the three dotted icon next to it and select advanced options. Scroll down underneath reset. If the app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. The app's data won't be affected. Select repair. Attempt to relaunch the Xbox application. And if you're still having a problem, you can come back in here and select the second option that if the app still isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. Select reset. This will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign in details. Select reset. And then once that's done, you would want to restart your computer and hopefully the issue would have been resolved. If you're still having an issue, you can do the same process for the other Xbox application, the Xbox Live program in here. Again, you would go through the same steps we did with the main Xbox application. And then once that is done, you would want to restart your computer. So let's go ahead and restart our computer once that has concluded. And then hopefully the issue should have been resolved. If you are still having a problem, you can run the system file tracker utility scan. So in order to do that, open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt, right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. And once that scan has concluded, close out of here and you want to restart your computer.
And there you go, guys. Hopefully this pointer issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.